Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. I had to make a video. I have to get on here today because this morning I was um going about my day and I was watching or I was reading a, a Daily Mail post on Katie Myers. She was a 22 year old Stanford student that um, presumed killed herself. Right. And I was I was reading up on it and I saw that she had made TikToks. And I'm making TikToks recently. This is my con I've just been making content. And um, so I decided to go on her TikToks. And she, her, I watched, I just, I watched a few, but I just, the one I watched was the last one she made about a week ago. Um, I don't know the exact day, but she was just saying, Happy Friday. You know, she got, she was going about her day, explaining what she was doing. And um, just her other videos, she just had a very, a beautiful smile, beautiful spirit about herself. And, uh, you know, I watched a little clip of her parents after, after the loss. And it's just, you, you could just see the heartbreak. Reading the comments on her post, you could see just people affected by it. And I just watched some videos, watching videos of her at the um, 2019 National Championship. You know, she was, she helped, she helped bring her team to the National Championship. And the way she was carrying herself in her video, and uh, I've had my own experience with uh, uh, suicide in my family and uh, just suicidal thoughts. Honestly, I'm human, right? And I just was just talking to myself after watching it. And I'm just saying, like, if, you, if you're if watching this and you having these type of thoughts harming yourself, suicide, I'm just trying to... From, from my from my heart I just I really don't want you to do it don't do it you know once it's done it's done and you know if that's God's plan that's God's plan but if you're able to watch this video and you're still on this earth you're here for a reason you know you have self-control you know don't go out because of your own self because you you it's just it's just not worth it to put your people through that hurt I've had my own thoughts, but I have, I told myself I'm not doing it. I know the love that my family have. I know the love my mom has for me and not everybody has that, but I, I, I would never have, I would never purposely uh, do that to myself so my mom or my pops could live without me. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather, you know, that's the worst thing, honestly. And it's just, it really moved me and stuff and she was just only 22 years old she was born 2000 and passed away 2022 you know and you're so young and and you know your spirit live on and the people you affect live on but when you do that you stop you stop time for yourself you're no longer moving with the world and the world is going to keep moving you know, and I, it's it's hard to think like that, and it's not really the most positive thing. But when you when you when you do that, when you make that choice and it go through, you you stay right there, and the world won't keep going. And of course, you're gonna have that 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 spirit through those people, but you stop you stop anything else you got going for yourself. You know. And, and 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 people have killed himself. She killed herself, and Christina Cordero Tyler killed herself. And you know, that's that's it, it was done. It's done. You know, and they're no longer here. But you know, and if they had spoken out or if they said something, um, you know, it's it's nothing that it could have been done at this point for them, but. Um, it kind of just invokes, provokes me to want to spread awareness on that. And I'm just trying to just say, don't, just don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I'd rather you get your anger out, punch, punch a hundred, punch a hundred wall, holes in your wall. I'd rather you do that. So after you realize the freaking pain on your knuckles, you will be like, it's not worth it. But once you, once you do it, once you do, once you once you commit that to that, once you commit to that and you're no longer here, you don't even see that it wasn't worth it because you're gone. And 
and um it, and you know i don't know what leads someone to actually doing that because i've never done that but um i kind of look at it once you do something like that and it's, it's sad to say but when you're going you're going and you stop there and the whole world keep going and it's just more more life being made more things happening so it's not like um i don't want to say you're forgotten because that's not that's not it but um you you make that decision to just stop stop it all and you you don't decide to keep going you decide to stop and and if that's the if that's what you want to happen um and, and that's gonna happen but i just it's not worth it you put putting your family through hurt like that putting people through hurt like that you know i'd rather you just if you gonna do something so crazy like that, I'd rather you, like, that be the last resort. And maybe that was, you know, but do something crazy while you're still here. Don't, don't, don't end it. Don't end it. Don't do that. Just, I'm just, I just keep saying that. Just don't do that. You know what I'm saying? If you're watching this and you're going through something, don't do that. I'd rather you do something crazy, like, like, tell somebody, oh, I'm, I, I feel like doing this. That's something even, I feel like. There's more brave and more courageous. And I'm not saying nobody a coward. But if you really feel like that, speak out. If that's how you feel and that's and if that's what you want to do, speak out. Because if because even because even if that's your even if you got your mind set on that, if you speak out, you never know. You know? It don't hurt because at the end of the day, that's what you already decided to do. So speak out. Fuck F it. Why not? Tell somebody, F it, why not? You know? And maybe you don't want somebody to stop you, right? But I'm just saying it's just not worth it. It's not worth it. Don't do that. If Katie Meyer was, was 22 years old. She had she had a beautiful um, spirit about herself that made me just want to watch make this video and touch a lot of people. And it's, it's, it's news. It's national news. And... Um, I, I just I just don't ever think that it's ever worth it to to do that to yourself. Uh, There's a lot of outside for, forces. I'd rather be from a natural something natural than from my own affliction. There's still work to be done on this earth, and when you take yourself out of it, you you don't give yourself that chance to to see it through. You know. Um, and I was saying, because I don't want to think like this, but when you decide to do something like that and time keeps going on, although you you have made an impact, I don't want to say you, you be forgotten, but you're not there. You're not there to, to, you're not there as the world is moving. You stopped. So you can't expect to keep it going. It's, it's not going to keep going for you. You stopped it. You know what I'm saying? Like, the world is going to keep going. And life is still being lived. When you stop it, um, you know, you just you just keep, you just, you just um, join the rest of the people that aren't here no more. You know, you, you going, you, you going. And I just, I just don't want nobody else to, to be thought of like that. Off your own affliction. You know, I talk about Kobe Bryant, he gone, but his name still live on type stuff. Um, Cause he didn't, it wasn't, it, he, it wasn't on his own affliction. I don't know. It's just, I feel like it's just kind of the two stories, him and Katie, you know, athletes or whatever, but his name still live on him. And, and obviously they haven't lived as the same life. Obviously just two different people. You know, I'm not trying to compare them in that aspect. But, you know, um, it's just hard, you know, because um, I was just reading her story. And I'm just like, you know, just another somebody just going too soon. You know, it's all in the comments going too soon. Rest up. And that's that's under 100 people's pa uh, pages. You know, what I'm saying going too soon. When you could when you could have kept when you could have stayed right where you was at, even though it was probably. You was going through some some crap, right? But you could have just stayed where you was at, and and kept making an impact, you know. She was making her videos. She's she and it was just crazy because she was saying, you know, 
happy friday it's only up from here i don't know what that you know what she was thinking at that time and what happened in the week for her to to go from that to today but it really um just it, uh it touched me i'm making videos i've been making videos consistently and i just wanted to make a video because that's a lot of the reason why i do what i do um, my sister-in-law killed herself and it totally shifted my my view on life um, when that when december 13th happened for me and my family 2019 and i just um i spread positivity because you know people are killing themselves people are, are killing people <clears throat> and the trauma that and that pain that the people that love them have to deal with after the fact is just heartbreaking when um you know it's it's inevitable for her for you know ups and downs in life but if you can just try to uh, minimize that in people's lives for other people you know it, i just don't want people to have to go through that stuff it's not it's not fair it's not it's just not worth it just just don't do it that's all i'm trying to say just don't do it keep moving keep it moving i you have to keep fighting that honestly broke my heart Um, I'm just going to end it right here, but do not, do not, do not do that. <laughs>